everybody, welcome back to Sweet Your Day with AJ. My name is AJ, and today I am doing a review on the chocolate pen. Um, I've used this once before. I can't remember if it worked. It was a year ago because I got it a year or two years ago for Christmas. This is what the box looks like. It just says chocolate pen right here. It says real cooking. Um, but you don't actually have to do real cooking. Four tasty colors. Um, draw and model. So, and then the top just says chocolate pen, chocolate pen. There is the barcode. And then it says chocolate pen again on the back. Looks like that. And then it just has ingredients. Um, and like total fat, stuff like that. So, some later on this. So, first thing. I just want to talk about four tasty colors. Mine only came with brown, white, and teal. So that's already one thing that isn't really a thing. Should say three tasty colors. Or if you buy the chocolate pen, maybe you can comment down below if yours came with four, I guess. Um, and it shows like 10 hundred different colors. Okay, whatever. Um, there's also fun molds. I do give credit for this. Um, so you are going to the first step, or and later on in this video, I'm going to grab a bunch of these. They sell them like everywhere, like Walmart, Fries, Target, whatever. And I'm gonna try it my own way. So yeah, without I go any further, let's move on to the first step. Okay, you guys, so the first step is to heat warm water um, to about what degrees? Boiling. Till it's just boiling. Um, and it is super duper hot. Then you're gonna put the three, the three colors in um, into the water. So I'm just gonna move it over here, but it's on a huge cutting board because I don't want it to burn the table. So make sure you have a clean surface. And I'm going to bring it over here. I put three colors in it. Just till the colors are melted, it said three minutes. So yeah, I guess we're gonna wait three minutes. All right, you guys, so now it's been more than three minutes and only the white and brown has melted, even though the teal is all the way on the bottom. Um, so next thing you do is you are going to grab this little piece and you're gonna take the bag and put it inside. And then you are going to cut it. Just the tippy top. Don't need to cut it a lot. Okay. So now you are going to open the pouch and put the tip inside. Ah. Uh, and the instructions seem way difficult. It took me like 40, 50 minutes to do it. And then that is in there. So now you have the pouch with the tip inside. So now there's a little plug you're gonna put. Oh wait, you're supposed to clamp it. down oh, this isn't working I'm supposed to clamp it right here so 
So I will catch up on you when I clamped it in. Goodbye. All right, you guys, that took way longer than it should. So far, this review, at like a three. So it needs to step it up. So once you get the tip clamped, you're gonna take the bag out and put this to the side. You don't need it anymore. It's wherever, I guess you wanna put that. You're gonna put this into the, hmm. It won't really fit. Oh. Let's see if it will work. It's already starting to come out, which is another bad thing coming out the sides. Eek! This review. Comment down below if this toy was good for you. This won't work. Um, so, I'm just giving the pen to my mom real quick. So, then if it does come out, there are these little pegs. And what, uh, chocolate got on my finger and I tasted it. It was probably the worst chocolate I've ever had. It's not good, not good at all. Um, by the way, it, it only gives you three colors and 180 molds. So I'm like, seriously? Serious. I'm going to use this mold over here. Um, one says, be mine, and it's a little hard. And um, there's the ghost, gingerbread, you know, a bunch of that stuff. So I'm going to spray this heart with wings. And I'm just spraying it with Pam. Okay, well, some come out. It didn't make the noise. I don't know. Um, let me spray the ghost. How do you get the drawer off? Well, I did it. And then let me spray the snowman. Here, I'll um, make sure you hear this so you really know I'm spraying it. There. I put the little peg in so you can see. And you're just going to take it out. Oh, yeah. It's, it's pretty gross. And I'm just gonna, and now you're just gonna push this button and you'll hear it. Oops, there we go. And then I'm just gonna put it in the, comes out very slowly. Okay, and then you have to pick. My mom's just going to grab a toothpick, and then it comes out like that, so I'm just gonna smooth it out, and it's gonna look beautiful. So now I'm gonna fill in the bunny. Here, let's make sure you can see this one. Oh, wait, let's smooth it out before it dries. Eek! This product needs to be prettier or something. So I don't know if you can see this one, but I'm just gonna fill it in. Look how gross it comes out. But whatever. And this is very messy. Make sure you do put like a cutting board or paper underneath. And the mold is clear, so it's super hard to see where the edges are. Cause it's not like 3D, it's like flat in. Comment down below if you get the chocolate thing, if yours is way better. I know I think I said that earlier, but I honestly mean it. Um, now, I guess, you, ooh, I wanna fill in the snowflake. I'm gonna try the snowflake without Pam and see how it is. I really hope the snowflake turns out well.
This isn't working anymore. Uh oh. Something's happening. Okay, I'm gonna use a different pen now. All right, you guys. So I kind of gave up on the chocolate pen because it it wouldn't cooperate. It broke. It all fell apart. I will show you. That's all the things. So I'm gonna try it my way. I think it'll work. Like I'm like a positive it'll work. Um, anyways, so all you need is candy melts. I have orange, red, brown, white, teal, pink, um, yellow in this, like, dark blue kind of pretty color. And I have them all laid out right here. And I'm going to melt them in a coffee cup and then put them in a bag. Now I'll show you what type of baggie I mean. I mean this baggie. And I'm going to cut the corner. And I'm going to put it into the mold. And comment down below if you think that will work. I honestly think it will work. Alrighty everybody. So I just melted the yellow. And you do need a lot of melts. But I did get some. Now I'm going to grab some scissors. Chop, each chop. And I'm just cutting the corner. I just cut the corner of the bag. And then I'm just gonna put it into the banana. Oh my goodness. It goes out super smooth. Oh my goodness, my idea is so much more genius than theirs. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I I got a better idea. It came out super smooth. It came out in a banana form. Um, so now I'm just gonna, here wait, look, look at the bottom. It's an actual banana. And there's tons of colors. So I'm just gonna plop this in the freezer um, in a sec. And I'm just gonna grab the mug and instead of putting it in a bag, wasting bags, just gonna get the spoon and dribble it in. And it's super easy to change colors. Oh, it went out so smooth. So I'm just gonna grab this. And again, I'm just gonna dribble it in. It comes out so smooth and pretty. No. The neon blue. You would know Bailey if you watched my second video. I'm gonna end this video soon. Um, cause you're probably not gonna sit and watch anymore. And so, just gonna put it in the freezer and I'll show you at the end. I have one more color, so yeah, I'll show you when they're out of the freezer goodbye all right you guys so it is later um it's about an hour later and i'm going to open the freezer and see how my chocolates are doing i'm just gonna grab one tray at a time oh it looks super good i'm just gonna grab a little piece mm. This chocolate tastes way better. Okay. I'm actually gonna do some shout outs. So today's shout out goes to M Stu. Thank you for commenting on almost all of my videos. And thank you Cam Morier, Morier for commenting on mostly all my videos too. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, make sure you watch my next video for more shout outs. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell down below so you can be part of the AJ Squad. AJ Squad. I'm AJ Squad. And yeah, without further ado, goodbye.